On school break, 13-year-old Bumbaya has come home to help his family handle its herd. The winter has been especially harsh, killing more than 40% of the family's livestock, a fate shared by other herders across Mongolia, who are reeling from the coldest season in four decades. For Bumbaya, information technology is a remote concept. He has no computer at home and no electricity to power one, even if he did. The closest he comes to cyberspace is at school, where he has learned about it in computer science classes, but he's never been online. The nomadic lifestyle of most Mongolians, along with the shortage of communication infrastructure in small towns, has made bringing modern technology to the classroom a difficult task. In the beginning, we had no computers. We only had Pentium 1. At that time, it was very hard to teach computer science. Since children learned by doing, my class was not very effective because children had no opportunity to use computers because there weren't any. The Asian Development Bank is supporting a new strategy to introduce information and communication technology into Mongolian education with a greater emphasis on human networks rather than on digital ones. Teachers from larger towns and cities with more IT experience share their knowledge with teachers from rural areas. The project also selects key schools in small towns that have adequate power and computer infrastructure to serve as IT hubs for the surrounding communities. Here, teachers and students gain computer training of their own and in turn teach family members and friends what they have learned. This project is a significant way to close the gap between urban and rural education. The herder children can improve their knowledge and intellectual capacity by taking necessary information from the internet. Also, the project helps parents get information through their children, increasing the overall public access to information and improving the quality of education. It is an effort to help bring children in remote areas into the digital age, even as they maintain traditional herding lifestyles that have scarcely changed over centuries.